no one is trying to go ahead of others in this practice. This is more subjective inner journey, dealing with whatever inner contents we have, wholesome or unwholesome, and therefore no one can feel better than the other. We sympathize with others' difficulties. We appreciate others' work. We rejoice in their success. So we can learn to be patient. When we rejoice in others' success, that helps us to progress in our practice, to relax ourselves. Let us wish, wish each other peace, happiness, solace and comfort. Let us wish each other success in attaining their goals. And may we all be peaceful and happy. May we all be successful in our practice. May all those who are supporting us and have supported us share this peace with us. This moment of quietness, peace, has been possible because of the help we get got from various wonderful, kind individuals. And we are all grateful to them. We all wish them be peaceful and happy. When we become peaceful and happy, we can repay their, our debt to them. We are just very sincerely grateful to them for everything they have done for us to make this moment of peace possible. Let us feel peace and loving, friendly feeling within us. 
loving, friendly feeling towards everybody. We honestly wish everybody be free from all mental unrest. May wish them be free from distress, disappointment, anxiety. May we wish them to be free from mental anguish. And let us also be free from restlessness, anguish, fear. And let us be free from afflictions, pain, difficulties, irritations, anger. Let our upward path become smooth and comfortable. And this very beautiful, pleasant, cool, calm morning, let us make our mind calm, cool and peaceful. Let every cell in our mind and body be charged with these thoughts of friendliness. Let us have confidence in our practice. We trust the Buddha. We trust this teaching. We trust all those who have trodden the path and attained the liberation by following this path. This is infallible path. So without any scruple of doubt we continue the practice. It brings us soothing, calming, peaceful effect. It relieves us of burden, pain and suffering. You can experience it even in the attainment of the first stage of concentration, meditation. All physical aches and pains fades away when you are in the first absorption concentration. That, in fact, is very insignificant compared to what is ahead of us. And yet, this so-called insignificant achievement is so lofty compared to the other experiences in life. To be free from physical aches and pains for a length of time itself is a wonderful achievement.
and that itself proves how effective, how infallible the method is. <coughs> This joy and happiness we experience from the first attainment is just the scratching the surface of the path. It is just being aloof from various hectic life. It is just the result of being aloof from various gross mental defilements. This joy and happiness arises from suppressing hindrances. Just imagine how peaceful and happy one can be when the defilements are totally eliminated. Temporary suppression brings us so much joy, peace and happiness. Permanent elimination is needless to talk about. Happiness we gain from permanent elimination of defilements is incalculably blissful, peaceful. Let us try to regain the same joy and happiness of concentration. Joy and happiness of being aloof from physical, hectic life and being aloof from defilement by just suppressing them. The basis of all of them are Initial application of thought comprising of three wholesome thoughts rooted on in wholesome roots generosity, letting go of our greed, attachment, attachment to selfishness, self promotion. Self, greed, letting go of that. Wholesome thought of compassion, wholesome thoughts of friendliness. These are extremely powerful. They are temporary achievements. Happiness arising from friendliness is temporary. Happiness arising from generosity is temporary. And happiness arising from compassion is temporary. And yet that temporary happiness Rising from these three wholesome thoughts still is very powerful. That makes us gain concentration.
focus the mind of happiness arising from friendliness, focus the mind on comfort we gain from friendliness, compassion, Focus the mind on the relief we gain from generosity. Letting go of all negative state is such a wonderful relief. We feel liberated, we feel total freedom. When the mind is settled down, becomes calm, peaceful, free from restlessness and worry, brings us great deal of peace, solace and comfort. When the mind is free from doubt, wavering state of mind, confused state of mind, we feel great deal of liberation, freedom, clarity, When the mind is liberated, even temporarily, from resentment, anger, we feel relief, as if we are relief from sickness. These are very noble thoughts. Wonderful thoughts that humanly we can cultivate. And let these wonderful, beautiful, peaceful thoughts sink into our mind and nourish the root of friendliness, compassion, joy, Feel the peace around us, within us, above, below, all around us. We feel secure, protected. Loving, friendly thoughts, compassion, appreciative joy, equanimity, are considered to be the thoughts of protection from various directions. The entire atmosphere, entire circumstances, environment around us should be felt, should be filled with 
friendliness, peace, joy, and happiness. Just imagine that we are enveloped, covered with this air filled with friendliness. May all beings around us in this atmosphere feel the same peace of friendliness, compassion. May peace prevails, pervades everywhere. May everyone feels peaceful, joyful, happy, relaxed. May the mind be calm and peaceful. May all gain concentration. May all have confidence. May all have strength to proceed with the practice. 